High flow nasal cannula. There are two components to the high flow nasal cannula. There's a flow meter on the side, it goes from zero to 15, and then the blender goes from 21 to 100% oxygen. When your patient is initiated on a high flow, the flow rate will be determined by the cannula size. The cannulas come in different sizes and are determined for usage by the infant size of the nares. The cannula cannot occlude more than 50% of the nares as we want a leaking system. We do not want a tight occluded CPAP system. The flow rate will start at six, seven, or eight liters. Your FiO2 will start at 100% and then will be rapidly weaned, watching the saturations to maintain saturations greater than 90%. Once we've reached 40% on our FiO2, then your RT will start to wean the flow rate. At any point, the child can be given a room air challenge. Take the prongs out of the nose, see how they would do on room air, and then we can see about discontinuing the oxygen. Your respiratory therapist will come and take care of your high flow setup and your weaning. If you need to titrate your FiO2, do that to keep SATs greater than 90%. Your respiratory therapist will titrate your flow.